Okay, when you're hemming to hem, the first thing I did was fold up a fourth of an inch to a half an inch, and then I rolled it. Most hems are about two inches wide. That's your standard size, so that's what I've left. And the first thing I'm going to do is I've got a needle and thread, and I'm going to tie my, a knot in the end of my needle. Whenever you're hemming, you are actually always hemming to the right versus the left, okay? So I'm going to run this needle in, and I'm going to hide it in that fold of the fabric right there, okay? First thing I'm going to do is I've got my hand, one hand underneath, I've got my needle in my right hand, and I'm going to skip over about a fourth of an inch, and I'm going to pick up, as you can see just on that white, one tiny little thread. You can pick up one or two, and then I'm going to run the needle this direction. Okay, now I'm going to pick up one or two little tiny threads in the green. I'm going to pick up one or two tiny little threads in the white. One or tiny two little threads in the green, and I'm skipping about a fourth of an inch. I'm going to do this all the way along. Two threads there, two threads here. And how you know when you're doing it right is if you pull it down, do you see how it makes forms a little V shape? That is a proper hem. And what that's going to do is allows just enough ease that if that gets caught on something, it's not going to rip your hem out. Gives it a little bit of wiggle room. So very, very easy. Two threads, pull straight, two threads, all the way across.